Hello, it's Monday, December 28th, and that means two things. First off, the Minataka Accords go into effect on the first, which is just a fantastic excuse to sell yourself some retrofits. And it's time for the lighting industry news brief. And speaking of kicking some gases out of your diet, Keystone Technologies has sponsored this episode with their outdoor fixtures. Let's get rid of some sodium, bring in some LED floods, some cutoffs, some wall packs, three types, low profiles. You can reduce your SKUs because you can select your color right on the device. Half of these come with a photo cell just for easy automation. Super non-frustrating on the job site because the mounting accessories are right there. Customized for style, customized for performance. That's keystonetech.com. Link in the description and the news. Signify is shrinking its HQ because, uh, well, it's one great way to reduce your costs. That's the main facility in Eindhoven. Uh, Cooper is raising their prices by 8% as of the 12th of February, as are MaxLite and TCP, not necessarily the 12th, but MaxLite's products will be going up by 8% in February, and will be going up, and TCPs will be sneaking up by 10% that same month. Uh, The LRC has a 55-page breakdown of UV disinfection. Get Read that while you can. Uh, LightServe has acquired Illumitech. Uh, these are a distributor and a solutions provider. We'll be merging Quantum Dot Startup Ubiquit. Uh, will be has raised seven million dollars in startup capital. They're aimed at making horticulture even more efficient. On Get a Grip on Lighting, we have George Filtzos evangelizing controls in episode one sixty seven. F.C. Lorient Groundsman has been killed by falling lights. He's a volunteer groundskeeper for the French soccer pitch. Uh, He was struck by a lighting rig earlier this month. He died of a heart attack, though, though, so it's not really fair to, uh, you know, let the lighting rig take the blame for it. Curtis Mathis has is going to seek the first ever DLC certification for their harvester system. That's a horticultural system. That will get the first sticker. Uh, Signify and Honeywell are joining forces on controls for UVC and human-centric luminaires. Tintech will be beginning production on six-inch wafers. They make LEDs, and those wafers will be 20% of their production next year. Velodyne has joined Qualcomm in their Smart City program. Uh, Velodyne makes LiDAR. Uh, LumiLeds is broadening their color lines, adding PC Amber, Lime, and Royal Blue emitters. Uh, Endeavor, uh, that's ampersand ever, uh, their next indoor farm project will generate 1.5 tons of leafy greens per day, as per their projections right now. Uh, Wolf River Electric, which also owns Light the Lamp LED, is expanding in Isanti, Minnesota. That's two 16,000 square foot buildings. The Canadian Organic Standards Council will now allow artificial lighting to uh, still be incorporated into certified organic products. These are only for short growth crops, uh, but it can be illuminated by 100% electric lamps. Uh, Still not letting hydroponic or aeroponic plants get that little sticker. MaxLight is suing ATG. This is the third such suit between the two companies related. This one is related to modular fixtures and mounts. Uh, Lighting editors will be discussing new technologies. This is a January 14th webinar from the IES. Dallas Market Center, you may recall, delayed their show in January till March, but that January show is still kind of happening because there will be virtual events on the 7th and 8th. Uh, This year, we saw fewer holiday lights imported from China, even as holiday light consumption increased, as you might remember from last week. So in rep agencies, uh, MaxLite has named a mid has named Midwest Equipment as reps for Iowa and Western Illinois, and Topstar is going a little ham with four different partnerships across the U.S. More details in the text version. In recommended reading, we have Justin Park reviewing Cree LED floodlights and Sky Genius corn lights. The 
Moonlighting Archive, IES's After Hours stream is now available. Kevin Poik is reflecting on 2020. Randy Reed is projecting into 2021. And we have a question of whether or not controls are the key to circadian lighting and a quick guide for XB versus Zigbee protocols. In R&D, uh, circad- we have a dis- study on circadian disruption and rotating shift workers you can check out. Uh, in local news, the Carlin Tunnel in Nevada is the first speed tunnel to be lit by LEDs. Warsaw, Poland is replacing 38,500 streetlights with smart LEDs. South Carolina is creating protected zones for sea turtle nesting grounds. Charleston is adding 151 solar lamps to bus stops. And Morrison County, Minnesota will be switching its streetlights to LED. And stuff you can build if you still got some time off. Uh, glowing origami, care of Charlotte Gonda. You can build a 3D printed Charmander, which lights up at the tail. Gotta catch them all. And something a little fun. Uh, Red Bull, their skydiving team, have created the Marfa lights. If you read your Charles Fort, that's a interesting lightning phenomena. In People News, Rexel has named Tony Killebrew as director. NEMA VP Patrick E. Hughes has been elected to the ANSI Board of Directors. Werner Electric Supply has hired Fred Mauerman as the VP of Ops. Paul Trainer is the new head of the Light Bureau. And Clear Blue has appointed Farouk Anwar as CEO. Oh, CFO. CFO. My mistake. And again, this is brought to you by Nailed. Get associated, get educated. I've been Scott Walker. Thanks to Keystone. Thanks to you. Have a great new year. Enjoy the music. Have a good week. This has been coldest winter of my life. Dreams, they have fallen like snow in the night. I don't smoke that, my job drug test Like some foreign and feel, I guess it's up there Real connections, yeah I love them Just to in the bubbles, can't get enough of them Depression like a friend that followed you around It's you only in the thing when you alone and feeling damn But I'm not much for entertaining These best against the studies at me So I feel this up with wood and music, music, love and pain In the journal with the post, cause my dreams when it's raining Whatever the piece I found, I keep the soul from fading Fears with is always found, I see it never plainly Lost day go in the auto dealer, how it pains me This has been Winter of my life Dreams, they have fallen Like snow in the night Guess life's just different than I expected I don't know, maybe I got new perspectives Either way, we're all fucked the way I reckon Cause I took our only hope And they filled it with deception And I would be pissed off But I'm too disillusioned Tied up to the answer The riddle with confusion Don't need another voice Snake and intrusive So give me love Cause all else is useless This has been Coldest winter Of my life Dreams They have fallen Like snow In the night Drop bombs like terrorists, never out in public. That was too embarrassing. You want people to see and not stare at us, so keep it to yourself like something that you cherish. Mom and dad, that was fucked up, believe me. Use my native trust just to go and deceive me. Now you got the nerve to ask why you don't see me. Mom and dad, can you really not see me? I'm somewhere different than a boy who coward on the floor. Patiently away and that final same door. I become a man, but not because you're me to be. Mom and dad, once you tell me that you're proud of me.